set up with the soda can mortar, uh, 2.9 inch bore. I have a projectile that's uh, re the recoverable that's uh, slightly under the bore size. And uh, we're going to fire it here. And uh, two, 360 grains of powder, and we have a, it's a heavier bed for it, so hopefully it won't flip backwards or do anything crazy. Um, and we'll also put some lock bolts on the trunnions to keep the barrel from flipping back. So uh, we'll give it a try here. Well, the tape didn't stay on it, so I'm going to go down. It landed in the middle of the runway, so I'll be right back. There's a hole it poked in the ground right there. And there's the 300. I'm way back there. So this is almost 400 yards, actually. Uh, yeah, there's... That's the end of the runway. All right, All right I'm going to measure it and get back to you on it. Okay, there's the 300. So I measured back. We are 360 feet past the 300 mark. So that comes out to 420 yards. And that's from just closing up the windage and increasing the powder chamber size to 360 grains as opposed to 300 in these um, 2.9 inch mortars. So we'll go back, do number two, and uh, the, the, most of the caution tape burned off of it. So I'm going to have to try something a little different, as you can see. There was enough on there for me to find it, but I'll we'll try it onto a paracord and try that. All right, we're going to try this paracord with the uh, caution tape tied on it. All right, this one didn't go as far, and it's over here in the cornfield. Now there it is. Actually, it all stayed together pretty well. I didn't see it real well in flight, but it stayed together. And it did not go near as far, probably because of the longer uh, caution tape on it. But there's the jug, and I'm going to measure it. Okay, 79 feet past 300 yards, that's about uh, 326 feet on that last one. Uh, we'll try again. All right, this uh, shot, uh, number three, uh, 360 grains of 2F, and uh, I have a short piece of, shortened up the piece of caution tape, see what kind of distance we get this time. Well, I'm still looking for the uh, last projectile that I fired, but I did find this. And this is actually from 2017. It's the one sauce can that I fired from the 2.9 inch uh, mortar back then. And uh, that's when we were having all the problems with flipping the bed over. And we split the bed on the one uh, four inch. And uh, it's 300 plus yards. There's the 300. 
uh, marker. And, uh, you know, if I was to guess, I'd say it's probably 100 feet past, um, maybe three, 330, something like that. Uh, still looking. So I'm just going to keep looking if I don't find it. Um, no sense in firing any more and losing them. Um, I'll get back to you here in a minute. All right, I searched quite a bit. Um, I have no idea where it went. So I'm just going to wrap it up. Thanks a lot for watching.